Hello and welcome to the Transformers Universe uh, Twitch live stream. My name is Mod Josh T, and with me today, or making his grand debut, is my main man, Mod G Dog. Hello. How are you doing today? Doing really good. Quite excited to do this. A little bit nervous. A little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we've got a, a, an interesting stream plan for you today, guys. So we're showing off you some new things. We've brought back. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, we took Energon Quest out of the game and we brought it back. So we're going to be showing you that, showing you how that works. It's a, a new mode where you team up. It's a PVE mode and you team up with um, three of your buddies and you take on like hordes of Terracons. So we're going to be showing you that. Uh, we're also going to be running through a couple of PVP matches. Me and G-Dog are going to go head to head. Finally, I can prove um, how good I am. It's going to be, ooh, it's going to be <laughs> no... Um, Oh, I don't know what I was going to say then. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're going to be doing We're going to hold back, basically. Uh, yeah. You're going to be rocking for Autobots, and I'm going to be rocking for Decepticons. You're showing it off. <laughs> it's the colour, it's the colour. Um, yeah, uh, so we're going to jump into a match now, so you can see that. Well, actually, let's, let's have a bit of discussion about who you are. Who am I? Uh, so you are G-Dog. I'm G-Dog. Uh, I work on the marketing team here at Jagex for Transformers Universe. Uh, very excited to show you how I play, yeah. um, especially it's considering it's been a while since I've played uh, Energon uh, He's a Quest. bit iffy. Iffy? <laughs> no! <laughs> well, you'll get to see anyway, and then we can rewind. If you can have like, an action replay later yeah. on, that'd be awesome. But I so. know, yeah, and after, I don't know if you guys have been following our streams, but about two or three weeks ago, I didn't have my best showing, and then Mr... Um, oh, we're getting abuse on the chat, which is nice. Sizzle 12, <laughs> I'm going to ban you. Uh, oh. <laughs> so that's good. Um, there we go. It's okay. Banned. Uh, yeah, so, and then we had our, our like, Chris Barrasso, who is a combat designer, come in and show us how to, uh, show us how to play a Sparkscape and stuff like that. So I've learned a little bit, and I'm going to be putting those skills into action today. Um, definitely, definitely. So yeah, let's bring up your screen. Hello. So what you've got now, who are you playing as right there? So I'm playing as Showdown. So he's my favorite Autobot at the moment, only because uh, our, our man Chris has actually taught us a lot of things. Most of our team <laughs> has actually taught me a lot of things on how to play, but Showdown really shines for me. Um, there's, there's a couple of ways you can play him, and everyone has their own techniques that you'll, you'll obviously learn as you play. Um, but for me, uh, there's a couple of uh, as, you know, his S tacks and his um, equipment that you can use really works for the way I like to play. I used to play as quite a sort of quick go in, go out, yeah. and, you know, attack people. But I found that Showdown's he's really good as kind of a heavy that goes in. Oh, we'll show you later. Uh, very, very well next to uh, Josh. Well, I can show Ooh, you how. Someone's shooting yeah. at me. Uh, who's, who's it's shooting probably. Uh, so yeah, so what we've got here, this is the Autobots outer base. So this is where you can, uh, you take on some, uh, you can take on Terracons here, and you've got two portals out here where you can jump into um, your uh, Energon quests, which are now called Crisis Mode. And so you can see there we've got one guy called Trombon, who is one of our team members, and we're just waiting for a few more to jump in. So if you want to drive around and show them some of the action whilst we... Um Shall we? And talk around. So this, yeah, this is a little town, little disused town in the outer base where the humans have abandoned, and so they don't know the Transformers are here yet. And we are, you know, we can burn around. We want to take on some uh, Terracons. Another thing about Showdown that I like is that it is a monster truck. Um, all the other vehicles are quite cool, but the monster trucks are quite. I don't know. It's I know. I, I quite like him. Yeah. He's. Uh, I love his hammer as well, so it's quite impressive. That, yeah, as, as I was talking about before, the hammer is actually one of the, the, the coolest weapons. I mean, it yeah. seems like it wouldn't be because, you know, you've got guns or something like that. But yeah. used in the right way, it's, it's, it's quite an effective technique. So, a uh, quick update on what the game is, really. I'll just bring, us, I'll bring our cameras back up. So what this game is, it's a free-to-play game that launches this summer. We're currently in closed beta uh, with the game, uh, with, with invites going out on a regular basis. Um, 
we're making additions to the game every week. And so you've probably seen, if you've watched a couple of our streams, you'll have seen improvements, you'll have seen new game modes being added. And these are getting added every week. Uh, if you want to take part and get involved in our beta, please sign up at transformersuniverse.com. It's a three-part process where you need to, one, sign up, uh, choose your faction and uh, pick your commander name. Uh, we will then, you need to validate your account. So to do that, uh, we'll send you an email which you then need to click on. Uh, after you've done that, um, the third the third part is you need to do specs collect. Uh, so if you go to transformationuniverse.com forward slash specs, uh, and you need to fill in there like what your, um, uh, you know, the specs of your computer. And once you've done that, we are sending out invites on a, a weekly basis. Obviously, uh, not everyone can get in, but we are, you know, we're getting through as many as we possibly can at the moment. Mm. So it looks like you've now got three guys there. So if you want to head back, um, let's have a look. Go back to our little town. There we go. Uh, let's see if we've got a one. He's there. Two more actually. Two whites. There we go. See, see, see Trump on there. Um, a little friend. Let's go back to the city. <laughs> it's nice. It's a nice little quaint town. You, you, you know, obviously deserve. <laughs> so there, there are terracons running around here where you can, uh, you can destroy them and you can take on. So they're like little missions given to you. So this is like when you're waiting to queue or anything like that. So you can do that. We will be uh, answering questions. Uh, uh, you know, throughout the stream. So if you have any, please drop them into the chat and we'll get to them. Uh, so yes, we're not sending out, you know, as I said, if just because you haven't got invites now. Oh, what's happened here? Oh, you've gone back to the hangar. <laughs> so what you can see here on the screen is the hangar. And this is where you get prepped for battle. So you can choose your bots. So you've got obviously showdown there. And you can see along the bottom other bots that we've got in the game. So we've got frontline, overclock, there your three starter bots. And then you have um, monsoon. And then the recently announced Sparkscape, which went into the game a couple of weeks ago. Oh, shiny. <laughs> uh, so you can see around the left and the right there, you can see uh, their weapons. So each bot has three weapons and then three equipments. And the equipments, so you can use the, the, the three weapons you can use all the time. They have like a cooldown period, uh, you know, if you use, to, use them too much. And on the right, you have your equipments, which have cooldown periods of about 20 to 30 seconds, Give roughly. Uh, and so that's where you need to use your, your tactics and your skills to come in to make sure that you know, you're know you using those at the right time. You know, there's offensive uh, and defensive ones there as well. So you just need to be making sure you're using them at the right time. You have, you know, there's customization in this game as well, which plays a massive part. You have here on the screen, which you can see, is where you can do your fine tuning. So, um, so this, is, this is basically how I play Showdown. Um, his attacks, the way that I like to play him is, is more of a charge. You'll see later on. Um, but his weapons are a spark and shield and shield. Um, but both of his weapons, the way I use it, it really works together. If I just come in like a full charge, um, I may, may not survive it, but it does help out my team. Um, and, and the way that you can use the, uh, the equipment that basically comes with that, yep. um, this works perfectly for me and uh, Showdown. Cool. Yeah. So yeah, so you can see here, so you've got the fine tuning where you can level them up. And then on the left hand side, you have power cores. So you unlock these at level when you hit level five, level 15 and level 25. And these guys, as you can put these in uh, and they give you like a small uh, stat boost based on whatever you want. So you've got that one there, which gives a, um, a virus debuff, debuff an and additional 7% damage. Um, but there's all different ones and you unlock those in the game. So you don't purchase those. They come uh, at the end of the um, End of the match. Sometimes End of the match, it, yeah. So it depends on how you perform. Uh, and it's the same. So we have two in-game currencies. So we have Energon and we have Relics. Energon you earn through doing Energon quests and doing um, throughout the game. And then you can also go outside and mine them. Uh, and you'll be able to do that. And so for that Energon, you can then use to craft stuff in engineering. So you can use that to buy uh, uh, healing packs and uh, add-ons to your bots and everything like that. And then we have relics. Again, you earn these in games through battles um, and you get rewarded depending on how you perform. And then you can use those relics to unlock new bots or fine tune your bots further. So let's, let, let's head back in with uh, Showdown. Let's go in. Oh, hey, we got some more people. Okay, cool. Come so here. let's, uh, so you can group up in, uh, in Transformers. So if you want to group up with them, He's showing off. He's uh, it's just loaded in now, isn't it? So you know you should be able to do it. Right click. Okay. 
maybe. <laughs> Possibly work. We just, just... Let's just, yeah, maybe they've disabled that for a moment. So if you just jump in the chat and say, um... Hello. Um, should we just go straight into Yeah, that? go straight to battle. Smiley. I'll probably attack you for Yeah, that. so we have chat, so you can do that. We also we do have grouping. Uh, for some reason, it's not working. We're playing on a, a, a different server, so it might just mean that it's not enabled on this one. Okay, so we're playing with um, players we've got online today. Are, so Mod Murdoch is one of the um, combat designers, and then Trombon uh, works in player support and is very regular on our forum, so you may have seen him there. Uh, our fourth man is coming. He is just a little late. <laughs> so we'll yeah, so whilst that. we wait, um, let's jump on and answer some questions. So if we've got any... Uh, so <clears throat> Andrews 10 a wants to know if we're putting this on YouTube. Yes, we will be. We'll be making a highlight of this and be putting it on YouTube. That'll probably go up tomorrow. Um, Just good. be good to actually have proof of our PvP matches. Someone's asking about console controller. At the moment, we're very focused on keyboard and mouse, um, but keep an eye out. We might be announcing uh, that in the future. Uh, again, future for this game on consoles, we're very much focused on, uh, on the PC platform. That's what... You know, here at Jagex, that's what we do. So that is definitely a platform. But we are making this game in Unity, so um, it's very, it's a very portable, uh, very portable browser uh, engine. Sorry. Engine, yeah. Heading into battle now. Okay, this is exciting. So <laughs> this is called a reservoir. So this is reservoir. Nice uh, snow in fact. So yeah, at the moment we're running this directly in browser. So there's no download here at all, guys. So uh, you know, uh, for me. Uh, you know, obviously I'm slightly biased, but it looks incredible for a, a browser-based game. Yeah. So, oh, sorry. Yeah. So what we're Show doing here? So you've got your three buddies, or well, just two buddies at the moment, but uh, Tyron will jump in in a bit. And what you've got to do is about three or four missions that you need to work through before you get to the end of the mission. So uh, yeah, if you want to transform, because that's what transformers do, uh, and head into uh, head into battle. Let's head on. Trying to bomb the spark escape. It was featured, was it last week? No, he's playing his meltdown, so he is your... Uh, uh, oh, right, no, he fooled me, sorry. Look, I didn't even know. That's, that's terrible. Yeah, no, he is your, uh, your healer of your group. That's, that's the... Uh... So, yeah, so these get progressively harder as you grow up through them. So you start off, start off quite easily, and there's about 20 or 30 Terracons that you've got to kill. And by the end of it, I think it's maybe 80 or 90. It could potentially be even Huge, 120. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and so you really... Uh, uh, we will see a lot of the... Uh, Offline screen, <laughs> especially. Well, that's, that's very supportive of you. Very much. <laughs> uh, and his, is that Tyron joining in the background? Uh, yes, he's in. Yeah, so, so we have good. a team of four now. That's that's so good. That'll make it uh, easier. Really so yeah, I'm uh, I'm not joining in in this one, but I will be playing in the PVE matches. So I'm here on your chat if you need anything. So we have some storming. So a ton of Terracons that have just popped up. Thankfully, we have a really good spread out team. We've got. Oh, we got healer. Yeah, so that's uh, Trombon there playing as Meltdown using his healer ability. He's just dropped one of his equipments there, that green uh, circle's on the floor. So if you stand inside that circle, you will be getting healed. So um, you need to be using those equipments wisely. So he can, if anyone stands within that healing green circle, get healed, including himself. And so you can see the, these blue cubes. Uh, which are dropped are obviously Energon. If any of you uh, are fans of the uh, Gen 1 cartoons from the 80s, you'll remember that's, you know, all the battles were about the, these glowing cubes of Energon, and it plays a very vital role in, um, in our game. So that green, uh, you know, Trombon's playing his role very well there. Uh, it's, it is a very balanced team, actually, who we've got here. It's yeah, very luckily, well. especially... Almost like we planned it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Um, Especially with our PVE missions, it's really good to have a, like a, an idea of who everyone's playing because yeah. if everyone goes as heavy, it, it might you know come to bite you at the end of the day. Yes, no, definitely. And you've got Tyra in there playing as Catapult, so she is you know a mid to long range character, so she's very good at uh, starting off mid and then once um, the, their energy is down, is getting in there quickly and finish them off. She's also got quite a nice little uh, sniper rifle as well, as you can see there flying in. Uh, going there. So what you've got to do for this this little mission is you've got to scan for energon and then mine to defeat the shield. 
But whilst you're doing that, Energon attracts a bucket load of, um, <laughs> of Terracon. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> oh, so you'll just see them coming wave after wave over yeah. the hills. So here they come. They start coming from the hills. So what you need to do is make sure that some of you are mining. So to deploy, you can see there, it says press F to deploy your... Um, and I've just deployed mine. Yep, so you can see it there. I'm doing it, and you can see at the top of the... Uh, they're scanning, and you've already hit 10%. But as you get closer and closer, more and more terracons come, and it gets increasingly more difficult. It does. <laughs> and, all, and all those lovely tactics you thought, oh, this is going good in the first year, yeah. you'll have to change it again, depending on who comes out. Yeah, no, and this is a completely different game style to like when you're playing 4v4, because... You know, people thought there's that tactics mode where you can work together as a team and pick people up one by one, whereas this is just the hordes yeah. and hordes of people <laughs> coming at you and you just need to, uh, yeah, it's kind of, you need to work together as a team obviously, but it really it's does. just kind of really killing as many as possible, it as is. quickly as possible, my, my favorite and defending attack. your mind. Yeah, exactly. There's, there's two things obviously you have to do, and, and as we were saying before, my, my favorite attack, it does take into consideration a 4 by 4 sort of attack mode but with 50 terracons yeah it, it, it doesn't it's not as effective it does work for, for larger yeah. guys and I'll, I'll show it to you when that comes up ah and you're in for a treat guys people on the in, in the chat you've got a uh, Gorgoth that's just come online and he is number one I think at the moment on our leaderboards oh. Uh, I actually emailed him today and he's not responded to me, so <laughs> sort that out. <laughs> he's busy, he's busy keeping, keeping He's too busy up. playing the game, literally. So there's about three or four players, every time oh. I go on and play the game, they are there. So you can see there, there's, uh, you've just activated one of your specials? Yes, what one of that? my specials, um, what it does is it actually has the cooldown effect for my, I think it's both for my axe yep. and for my minigun. So it cools down a lot quicker, so if you are, if you had taken down someone's shields, for example, yep and all that's left is spark. Um, you pull out your axe and you press uh, four in, in this case. And, yeah. uh, and basically means you can just keep swinging your axe yeah. uh, again and again and again, which is amazing after they have no uh, shield. No shield left. Yeah, yeah so you can see that you've hit your, uh, so you refined energy on capacity to be reached. So yes. do you, what do you need to do with that then? Could you need to deposit it or? I would like to deposit it. So hopefully I see it in the distance. Deposit point. So when you find a deposit point, if you've reached Thousand energon, you actually come up to one of these defo uh, de deposits, <laughs> deposit points, uh, without getting killed, uh, and then you hold down F, and this is just to drop off what I've collected in energon, and I can use this later on in game, both in PvP and PVE. Ah, okay, cool. If you want to use it for a shield, then right? yeah, so you can press E, for example, yeah, and it brings up a an energon shield. Cool. So you can see it in the top right there. It's uh, it's depleted, so that's good. Up here. There you go. <laughs> Should, I would not do that again. I would not look at myself. You know. He's All right. So Murdoch might need a bit of help with that same technique I was talking about. So I'm just pull up my axe. Continue. Actually, he's got it covered. That's fine. That's the thing that there is a lot of heavies, a lot of uh, sort of uh, smaller characters as well that you need to take into consideration. Uh, let's, let's just help. As I said before, part of being this character is he, he does take, another one of his equipment does take a lot of hits. You can actually switch some of your health for shield. Okay. And then another one of his uh, equipment, if I'm correct, um, will take half of your shield, but then divvy it out to the rest of your teammates. And then anyone that hits you, it's, it's 175% absorbed. Okay. So it's a really good strategy if you know you're going to be hit uh, and your teammates are probably in need of the help as well. And, you, and you've got some good uh, shield. That's oh, one guy left. He's hiding up in there. <laughs> Sorry, Bella. Sorry. Meet him face to face, that's good. Alright. So, how much do you need? I see you still got 75% 25% to go. Oh, yeah, 25%. <laughs> so, I'm put down another mining probe. Here they come. All right, so this is the gladiator that's just come out as well, so obviously a bit heavier. Yeah. Um, I, do, I can actually do what I want to do again. Oh, there's another one. You can see at the bottom right how quickly my charge for the hammer is. It's probably, yeah. At, at the moment, it's my favorite strategy, and telling this to Josh right now is probably a bad idea. <laughs> Considering that I'm going to be bursting him later on, so if he sees a uh, uh, showdown charging at him, then he knows exactly what I'm going to do. But it still works, because it works. Ah, and oh, one, right, look at that. And one exit is also, you guys in the chat, you're spoiled by our, our, you know, our top players in Royalty. beta. 
So one exit is also there. He is uh, one of our. Um, yeah, I think he's second or third on the. It's um, amazing, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, so this week, guys, we've got um, other other streams planned as well. So we're doing um, from our American office on Thursday. We'll be doing some streams from there. Um, so. Chris Barassa, will, who you might have remember from a couple of weeks ago, will be on those ones, and he'll be uh, showing off um, how to take, you know, how to play as Autobots and Decepticons. So if you're playing on the Nevada server, make sure you jump in because uh, he'll be looking for matches. It'd be great because he'll probably give you a lot of techniques as well. Whether yeah. he's yeah, actually destroying you or uh, on your same team, <laughs> it doesn't will matter. Be learning. He's, yeah, <laughs> if you find any of the mods, uh, maybe it's beside us. Um, they will help. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just going to deposit again because I've reached a uh, thousand energon and defend myself in the process. Yeah, you're getting hit there. So we are also, I don't know if any of you guys are, are who are listening right now are going to BotCon this week. So Ooh. it's uh, the, you know, official Transformer conference that um, is being held in Pasadena. Uh, our one and only Mod Crow will be there for the whole three days. So if you are, um, if you're going, uh, please stop by and say hello. This is the Mod Crow, by the way. Yeah, the Mod Crow. The Mod Crow. Uh, made no famous else. in Dancing Gifts. So. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. I know you, you may not, but it really it br it brightened up the office for, for the person that created that. He probably doesn't want to make another one. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> I like We're a, always up for more dancing. Yeah, here. yeah. Like a, so, like as a you can see, then, so you've moved on to the onto the next mission now, and now this one. It's not about uh, mining Energon, it is about destroying Terracon. So you've got to hit 80. And as you can see there on the screen, it's you've got to, uh, you can build your own, you can use your build mine Energon to build turrets, which will help you destroy, destroy the Terracons. I am taking some heavy damage and pressing buttons way too much. I am going to ah, run. Yeah. <laughs> now, it's okay to run um, as long as you know, yeah, if you get into that, so you've got a greeter, oh, you've missed it. So, um, yeah, Trombon's there, making sure you're topped up. So that's nice. Oh, Good little teamwork. Again. Thank you very much, Trombon. Yeah. Much appreciated. Oh my god, so yes. He knows what he's doing. Yeah, see, this is this is the point where we need to bring more than just this. There's nothing wrong with us coming because, you know, it's it's both teaching how not to play or at least what to expect, I think, when you're pre coming up the first couple of games. Pardon, sorry? <laughs> yeah. I was winning. Ah, and so, it's so mungry's on the chat as well. Oh, oh wow! Wow. Uh, so so mungry, I think, um, is about to put up one of his um, first videos, um, showing like a first look at the game. Ah, oh, defeated. <laughs> so you need to make a choice now, Gerard. As a commander, you need to make a choice. And what is that choice going to be? If you head back to the hangar, are you going to stick with um, who you were? I've forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> or are you going to head back? I am heading back. With someone else. Change yeah, you know what? Up. Because there were some issues with uh, how I was playing. Yeah. I'm going to come into the game with Meltdown. OK, so you're going, we're going two healers. Two healers. We're mixing up with two healers. See how that goes. See how that goes. Nice balance. Uh, yeah, so, so Mungry is in the chat. This guy is uh, wicked. And he is a big Transformers fan, has a great Transformers channel. So. Uh, you can set, uh, check out his channel. He'll be putting up some Transformers videos, Transformers Universe videos, I think today. Um, but he will give you the details in the. Um, uh, yeah, I think he'll be giving. Yeah, he'll he'll dr drop down the details of where you can check out his uh, videos. So yeah, so we've come back in now. You, you thought that there was a, a healing imbalance and they were getting taken down a bit. Yeah. So I'm just helping out my Tyro. He okay. was really low on health, and Trombone and I are just. Him up, but I turn has the advantage of picking up with the sniper rifle um, to a certain point. He's yeah, I, Catapult has a wicked, um, absolutely a wicked uh, equipment where she can just shoot straight through your um, your shield and go straight onto your spark health. And you're, you're, you're running around thinking, yeah, I'm oh, sweet, right. I'm sweet, <laughs> I'm t I've got full health. But then all of a sudden, especially as I play as desktop. And she just one two on that uh, on on that special on that equipment, mm. and it just goes straight through me, and I'm dead. And I'm like, but I was full health. How did that happen? Um, yeah, no, and it uh, makes me a little bit sad. Uh, but yeah, no, she is. Uh, yeah, she's that's that one thing, and she can pick you off from miles away as well. Mm. Uh, so you seem to have uh, 
brought the battle to Catapult. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not her. her the law of attraction of that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So it's. Uh, uh, we've got a Sparkscape in now. I love a bit of Sparkscape. She's wicked. Yeah, we did. Uh, he's wicked. He's got like yeah. two. He's got his cracking little. Uh, uh, frame for her, which can just gives you like this burn effect as well. So you can leave people, you know, if you leave them with about 20% of health, you just set that on them and run away, and uh, they will just burn to completion. Uh, so it's quite nice. You're not even bothered about them. Uh, you know, you're not even there for their their defeats. You just <laughs> just walk away. It's like the final insult. <laughs> <laughs> so what happened? Oh, oh this look is at this guy. So you're into your final guy. Yeah, and he is a beast, and he's not alone though. He brings others with him, and so you start off with just him. Yeah, this is all right. And then all and of a sudden, a little wave comes in. This is what's great about PV as well is that you, be, you, you get really, really good at a PVP match. You think really good, and then obviously with PV, there's so much going yeah. on at the same time. You might be concentrating on, the, on, on a heavy guy, and then three little um, turcons come from the corner. Pretty good. Yeah, no, it, distance, this seems good. to be a lot more balanced. Maybe that's just because you're not in the battles much. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, the medic doesn't want to be right in the heart of the battle. He wants to make sure everyone's okay. He's the support. Hey, so that's a. Uh... Uh, Megatron, uh, four, 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 four. Uh, you'll be able to stay in the beta until we go into uh, until we go to launch. We won't kick you out or anything like that. You will be able to stay there. So that's fine. Don't worry about that. Uh, no, actually, you're not getting a lot of. Um, you're not getting a lot of grief. But saying that, uh, I so please I bring it because I always <laughs> get. Uh, That's fine. I'm going to show the. Uh, uh, Mungri's getting a lot of love. Yeah. He deserves it. <laughs> you see him play last week. It was it was awesome. I was on on his team. It was just. You really knew how to play. Alright. So we've just done that. We've defeated massive uh, Terracon there and we're moving on to the next objective. So this is the final objective. So the, these sessions can... Uh, this, we've got two maps in at the moment for... for the, and this is the uh, easier one of them. Uh, uh, and this one runs for about, I'd say like 30 minutes-ish. 20, mm. 30 minutes. And the other one uh, runs for about 40 minutes, I'd say. It's a, it's a, it's a uh, good it's a, but it's a hot, yeah, it's like, they crank up the level on that one. <laughs> uh, so it's really rewarding as well when you actually, when you do complete it. Um, but yeah, no, I, I do like that mode. And it's good, like, you know, it's a good place to, when you, you're starting out, it's a good place, to, you know, it's a good, like, testing ground for you. Yeah. Um, so, you know, you're not going up against um, other players. You're just, you know, you're working amongst yourselves. You can try out different bots. Uh, it's, you know, it's a good way to kind of get to grips, work out their strengths and weaknesses. Exactly. I, I was saying before that uh, Showdown's my favourite character and I switched and this seems to be working for me a lot better. Because yeah. I'm, I'm very much used to doing the whole 4B, 4B, 4B uh, yeah. words. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so you, you'll start to learn what works for you, especially in these PvE missions. Yeah. You'll probably go back and, you know, with three friends, I, yeah, constantly play with it. Yeah, it's and you've already, what, you've mined about two, two and a half thousand uh, bits of energy on? Yeah, so, so I've done you know, two. that's a really good way to, you know, for your, when you're back in energy engineering, so you can build up your repair packs and your things like that. So it's a good way to get yourself ready for playing some big battles as well. We're doing now is we're destroying the shield generators. So yeah, so someone's just asked, it, will there be a, a map with a, 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 a rail yard to fight or something? We do have like one. Uh, we have Helios Storm. Uh, just changed the name of some of our maps. So I think it's called <laughs> Helios, uh, and that has that's like a freight one. So it's like a um, yeah, it's got like some. Uh, it's got it's almost like it's got like an empty drain in it, and it's got all like shipping containers and stuff like that. But we are adding maps in. Uh, and things like that. So, mm. um, you know, if you've got any ideas or anything like that, we'd love to hear them. Please head to our forums. Uh, and, you know, if you've got any ideas for, for bots, anything like that, we'd love to hear it. Yeah. <laughs> and the same, same on the stream. You know, we're, we're quite, we're, we're just starting out with this on the stream, and this is probably our sixth or seventh one. If there's anything that you want to see, if there's any kind of like, um, you know, if you want to look at warrior spotlights, if you want to do, uh, you know, 
community matches and things like that, anything that you want or you know any challenges that you want us to do, let us know um, and we will um, yeah, we will put them in because we're always looking for new ideas. So if you want to do that, yeah. either leave them in the chat now or drop them into our forums. So as you can see, um, we've destroyed a couple of the generators and now the enemies have flooded in. See that thing there? So one of the Terracons there dropped a um, immobilizer which you walked into. Yeah. Which wasn't wise. <laughs> Just showing the people what not to do. I'm very good at um, as you can see, I've been taking on characters, on characters, uh, enemies on my own. What I should be doing is helping my teammates. Um, this is the reason why I became a healer. Instead of becoming a doctor and being like, oh, I just don't like helping anybody. I just like learning how to. <laughs> uh, someone is asking about when is Diabola going into the game. Uh, so we announced Diabola two or three weeks ago, I think. Um, we haven't announced a date as of yet when they're going into the game. Um, but please, you know, as soon as as soon as we know, we will let you know. Dabba looks like quite cool. I like the yeah, I like the little one. I I, I have played as her, and she is uh, she is good. <laughs> <laughs> but that's a good thing about us introducing the characters. <laughs> if you look at if you look in the map on the top right hand corner of the street, you can just see. Uh, the waves and waves of uh, <laughs> of Terracons oh. there that they've got to destroy while still trying to destroy the shields. Um, after this, you move on to one final boss, don't you? And mm. that boss is absolutely huge. Uh, I keep falling into the. Oh, that's a good idea. Let's. Oh no! Reverse. <laughs> there we go. Name is our um, singing. <laughs> Helping each other out, we're getting chased down. Right. That's what happens when your moments of stress in the game you start making silly, silly songs. Sense. That's okay. That's why I did not become a singer. <laughs> still time, though. Still time. Still time. It's still time. Still time. Okay. So we're all healed up. I think we're. Uh, Good to go. So yep, so this is the final, final boss. I don't want to go, I don't want to go, I don't want to go. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you'd probably get here. So you might like, I, 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 if you do uh, fall out of the battle, you probably will want to mix it up, because I don't know if you'll need two healers. Yeah, this, this may not be the Terracon best strategy. Terracon Titan. Look at that look at the amount of health they have. It's absolutely insane. Our strategy here is to not fall eliminated, as usual. Uh, okay. Even me walking backwards is not. He is very, very quick. Yeah, and he does shoot. some a serious amount of damage. Huge So, uh, yeah, it's good to, you know, uh, I think it was Murdoch is running around. He's doing a good job of setting up the, uh, the, the turrets. The turrets will be good for this one because they will be picking off the smaller Terracons so you can focus on the big guys. Whoa, he was charging at me. That was quick. I am Aqua on that. I was immobilized for a second, now I've just escaped. And now I'm going to do my job of healing. This is great. So, so is, yeah, is there anyone anyone on the chat going to Epicon? Anyone heading there? Oh, yeah. Uh, anyone, anyone going to any... We also are at Epicon. Epicon in Holland, uh, which is uh, July, July yeah. 4 to 6, uh, and then we are at Comic Con in Manchester, which I think is the 19th of July, which unfortunately is also my nan's 90th birthday, so I won't be attending. As right. I will be wishing a very happy birthday to my nan. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a radio cool. station, those fun facts, ain't mine? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, yeah, so... Um, ah, that's it. Congratulations. So, as you can see here now, this comes up <coughs> the end screen. I'll just turn off our cam so you can see um, everything that comes through. So, you can see um, uh, the level. So, you can see the XP that you earn throughout the whole, for that whole battle. So, you can see, you know, what your level. As you get at each level, you get two new... Uh, tuning points for every bot, so that's good. 
Uh, so they're, they're vital to kind of make sure that you, um, you know, you level up and fine tune the bot how you want to. You can see at the bottom there as well coming <laughs> through the medals and the achievements that you unlocked, which give you more XP uh, and more uh, and relics as well for rewards on how you played. Oh, I love that store. There's a score streak at the bottom. Get a thousand score without dying. So what I'm very good at doing is, is obviously being an escape artist, which was my fourth um, champagne moment. Uh, and you did quite well. Yeah, so. repairing streak. That's not yeah, very bad. So that's good. F like it was this is the first and a John I've done in a while. So I'm pretty pretty happy with that. So yeah. So if you click continue. So what we're going to do now. We're going to jump in, so that team there is going to be taking on. I feel slightly like these games, are this, these teams are unbalanced. No. Mainly because I picked them. So, <laughs> <laughs> I, um, yeah, so we'll head back into the inner base. I've picked these, so on my team I've got Benny, who is the uh, lead combat designer. I have got um, Sam, who is one of the uh, lead QA guys. And I've also got Blue, who is in QA as well. So. It's a bit of a grudge match because I always lose against Gerard. Uh, so, uh, G Dog, even. So, <laughs> I'm pretty. Uh, it's okay. I'm going for it, and that's why I've stacked the, the odds in my favor. Well, no, it's good because then if he, if he beats me, it's like a triumphant moment. If, if I beat him, then. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Try again. I don't know. Have Feel? we got. Uh, so, I don't know. Have we got. I think. Yeah. So, this is on my screen. Woo! Uh, so we, we're rocking, uh, yes, yeah, so this is the Decepticon inner base. Um, so you can see here, so I don't think, it, I think we've changed the map slightly since the last stream, so it's a bit more neon, it's got a bit more uh, outflow there. Um, we've still got um, the score of the, the faction war. Uh, you go down here, where this will take you to the outer base where you can get to the, uh, the crisis modes. So yeah, so if you, if you are into the beta, uh, yesterday we added in uh, the crisis mode again, which you've just seen uh, Jawa play. To see that, uh, to enter that and play that game, you need to go into the outer base and you'll find uh, portals there to jump into. Um, and we've still got the, the automatic queue for PvP. Uh, so if you want to join a PvP match, you just click yes, join the queue as you can see on my screen, or um, you head to the outer base to go into PvE. So. I'm just waiting for the guys to load in. We're just mixing up our team, making sure we've got a good balance. Uh, I, I'm obviously, Blue was uh, playing as Dust Storm, and I outrank her, so she has gone <laughs> to change. <laughs> uh, so we're just waiting for um, yeah to get our, or everyone back, and then we will head into battle. Fantastic. So, so I, 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 well, let's uh, rock it from your side to begin with, uh, G Dog, and then we will. Right, so as you can see, I've picked Showdown again. Um, so I've just explained my whole tactics and how I play to my enemy, which is fine, because uh, I will then beat him with it and show him that, even though he knows it's coming. Um, uh, I don't play with tactics. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing, like when you first play, you're just getting the hang of it, you don't really know what your <laughs> tactics are. Um, and as I said, this is my only tactic. Um, but it works. So when you choose a character that you really like and you find out what kind of equipment and s techs that they do, um, when you go into battle, you, you, you pretty much know how you want to attack and, and defend as well, depending if you're a healer or both. <laughs> it's very good to do both. If, if your character can do both, it's, it's good to know the strategies that you can use as a healer and, and as an attacker. Oh, All what's right. That? What's happened there? Just pop in. You'll be fine. Yeah. Here we go. So, so what we play? Ah, I'd say we're in. Uh, yes, yeah, someone's just pointed out uh, on the uh, <laughs> that the. Um, oh no! What's happened? No, Why is that not joined us in? Uh, Benny. Benny's in. Ah. Hmm. Okay. So sure. let's see if you can pop in. Which yeah. is fine, which is, we've, yeah, we've got some time. But yeah. Yeah, so yeah, someone's just pointed out that, uh, that it doesn't add up to 100 on the, on the faction war. Uh, we are aware of that. <laughs> you never know, know, there could be or neutral uh, Transformers <laughs> who haven't chosen a side yet. <laughs> the, the undecided. Yeah. Um, if it's over 100%, then you know, double agents or something like that. I don't understand why it's done that. Uh, That's OK. I, <laughs> if you can see my chat down, uh, Trombone is starting to discuss tactics. Um, who do we sh shoot first? Um, at the moment, we all know who to shoot first. <laughs> the first in, but we're 
obviously waiting for the rest of the team to pop in. Ah, I think we are into the match now. Fantastic. Apologies. So yeah, so a lot of you are asking about the PvP and uh, PvE stuff like that. At the moment, just because we want, uh, we're, we are very much trying to balance our, um, our PvP okay. things where we're really focusing on the combat. So at the moment, as soon as you load into the game, we, uh, we automatically queue you. Um, once we get more players into the game and once we're happy with the balance, we will uh, we'll turn that off and you'll be able to queue with what you want. So the map that you saw lit up, you'll be able to choose if you want to play PvP on a certain map or if you want to play PvE. That is something that we do. That's everybody in for... Yeah, so the four. game starts in 18 seconds. I would just like to say, before we play, um, if I do beat you, uh, I will dance off screen <laughs> um, or else I will become a GIF as well. <laughs> Uh, we do see chat, whoever is asking. Someone from Bulgaria, I think. And we're off. On your feet, then live on your knees. So you can see two of my teammates have headed right, but we can see them on the map. Go. So yeah, so we, we've got to stick together as a team, but... Oi. Daring attack here, which is fine because I'm going to charge. I'm pretty sure because I've just announced how I'm going to play, <laughs> it might take me down, which is the reason why I have tried to attempt my strategy. So I've just was knocking down Tyron and Benny and. Uh, I think it's Benny and Blue just ran in there and finished uh, that off. I was using Dust Storms. I used her, uh, one of her equipment to make sure that you know, to, they're knocked down. So I've just done the knockdown on G Dog. Oh, uh, so everyone else can run in and finish him off. Never. <laughs> Never surrender. I will run. All right, there we go. So as you can see, <laughs> I. Um, I'm getting cocky, obviously, but, but uh, I take my everything I can. Well, it's really turned around, so obviously, as you can see in the first... It's turned around, one, minute. one kill, and then you finish. <laughs> and we've taken the lead. As you can wow, see, that's I really speak turned way around, too Gerard. soon. Well done, but, you, uh, dog. <laughs> which is fine, but... Let's try and keep taking number two. Go. Oh, so I can see. Even he doesn't see. Oh, blue spotted me. Blue's, blue's, blue's. He's very good at finding things. All right, so I've knocked down all of his shield, and now I'm just going to do my lovely swing attack, which is, as I say, my favorite. And it worked. Yes, it worked. So an actual tactic that, that works. Um, maybe only once, and then we'll see. So I was two versus one, so I'm going to get out of there. <laughs> <laughs> I can see you going. Hi. Run. So, from here. Um, so yeah, there, there is no shame in, in running off if you are low on your health. You need to um, obviously get back up to fighting. So when you're in, chance. when you're and when you're in vehicle mode as well, you have um, they have equipment. They have one equipment and they have one weapon. Ooh. Mudlu is trying to pick us off with a cycle rifle, but it's run away. I see Josh. I'm not going to pick on. Um, but yeah, this is chaos. <laughs> <laughs> it was great hearing uh, in the last couple of weeks how everyone else plays. It's, I mean, obviously you're not going to have Twitch streams of your enemies uh, in the weeks previous to learn how they play. Um, but at least for Chris, when he was here, it was great to see you know, what he was suggesting, how he sees battles. And oh, I just seen that. Uh, <laughs> again. We're still winning. We're still winning. Well, it's true. Yeah, it's really close. So. <laughs> now I can see me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can see you. All right, there we go. This is a very close match. Oh. I, I feel like I may be the weak link, but <laughs> I'm looking forward to when uh, when we go into open beta is to do some like community focused games where 
Hopefully I won't be the worst. Oh, uh, Rome. <laughs> you got your eye time. Easy, easy, good lad. I know. My team's gonna be shouting at me. I am <laughs> uh, Run away. Another random song, not trademark. You guys can have it. It's fine. Run away. Run away. I'm the slowest guy here, I think. But I'm just gonna pull back from my team. I was going a bit lone wolf. I was making the mistake of going a bit lone wolf. There. So I'm gonna knock him down. And no, actually, no, I'm not gonna go lone wolf as we just discussed <laughs> <laughs> 10 seconds ago. But uh, yes, let's see if I can at least still uh, get tipped us here. Oops. Nope, I'm going down. Yes! Down there you go. So you can see here, um, there is obviously. Uh, energy on countdown so if I was using a power core that gets disabled until I repair it at the moment I haven't equipped anything so you can still see it the below uh, deploy so I'm just going to deploy which is okay I really should have put a power core on knowing that these guys probably do <laughs> power cores on but if, uh, if, if we win a glorious, glorious win that will be <laughs> yes no I've got a kill, i got a kill, i got to chase you down. This is like the revenge uh, chase. Oh, it is a full on. <laughs> no, come back. No. Was that? Oh, it wasn't me. It's OK. You don't have to be the one that defeats. Someone does. Hold oh, no, on, down again. OK, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't be playing showdown anymore because I'm using the same tactic and it's as you can see below, uh, warrior offline. That means that my character needs to uh, be repaired. So you can. There's a couple of options you've got there, isn't there? If you want to talk them through that. Yep, yeah, sure. So you can see on the left, energon repair. So what we're doing before in the PVE matches is you can um, basically store all the energon that you collect through your matches. So I can repair with that. But there's also use repair packs, and these come in really handy if it's in a really really tight match, and uh, you want your power cores back or you really want your character to heal and you don't have enough energy on. I'm going to try... Uh, one soon. Woo! I mean, I'm going to try... <laughs> nobody. I'll be innocent bystander. Oh, we've got a fellow Aussie online. Hey. Don't say hello. G'day! <laughs> How you going? Uh, so, whereabouts in Australia are you from? I'm from Perth. I'm from I've well, never been. Hey, he's never been, <laughs> for one. Two. I did live in Australia for three years though, and I loved it. I so absolutely. Anyone from Perth? He's from. Uh, he stayed in Sydney. Yeah. Probably... We have lovely wines and cheeses. <laughs> I thought you could say we had lovely wives. <laughs> Plural. <laughs> Wooden I know many people who have wives who are lovely. <laughs> um, yes. Hello. It's great to. to from an Aussie. My accent is not exactly straight for you. I might to everything. It's weird, when you move away from, from the country, it seems to disappear a little bit. Did you pick up an Australian accent when you were Not at all. No. Uh, I watched a lot of Kath and Kim when I was there, though. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect training for a particular accent. Yeah. You can come back and, and uh, press your friends. Oh. Shouldn't have survived that, but I did. Let's see if I can heal myself. I am definitely outnumbered again. I'm gonna run away. Even though my teammates just charged in, which is not. Hey, Luke. Yeah. Oh, can I do it again? Ah! Can I... Oh, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. <laughs> so close. I nearly did, got you. Did you want to switch to your screen? Because I might be embarrassing you too much. That's right. Okay. <laughs> right. So, it is quite a tight match. We have just got the shields down. So those shield to go down. Oh, a bit too early. No, don't run away. So I've just knocked G, G Dog down. 
but no one's there to finish him off. But I get up again. Oh, Murdoch, you're mine. <laughs> Murdoch, you are mine. Stay away from him. Ah! There we go. You're stuck. Don't hide. Run. Don't hide. Run. <laughs> <laughs> Dead. Like, I'm so gonna get told off by my team. <laughs> I'm just feeding kills. I'm just feeding kills. Uh, oh, I'm getting lazy. That's, that's terrible. I apologize. <laughs> Sorry, team. Oh, wow, this has really turned around. I know, that's all because of me. Because they were not near my base. See, the good thing is you're either winning or you're helping someone else out. It's, it's very sweet of you to be able to help us out, you know? Yeah. So sometimes you can help the other people out. I might just hold back a bit. Let them, <laughs> <laughs> Let them do the job. Josh T has started reading a book in the game. <laughs> Chapter one. Oh, it's getting intense. Swinging axe. Oh, he's going. <laughs> when it's an axe fight, you don't know who's going to win. Um, unless you. <laughs> I'm going to bring out my favorite. So, guys, we're probably pretty close to finishing this match. So, if you have any uh, questions. Um, Please start leaving them in the in the chat, and then we will address address them. Sorry, I was just involved <laughs> in a bit of a, a gunfight then. <laughs> Wake up! Uh, oh, it's getting tight. Oh, wow, we just lost. And you know why that was? Because I wasn't in a battle. <laughs> <laughs> Strategy. All right, so uh, I'm coming to help. So because it's such a tight game you really need to pe uh, pick your battles and in this instance lost Devonir is Denver sorry lost Denver is uh, very low on health so we're gonna just gang up on him uh, that has backfired because <laughs> as I said tactics can change so we've got it back equal oh. Hiding away, as usual. Okay, one more. This is tight. Takes many. Everybody. Oh, shit, run. Oh. <laughs> oh, geez. Can you just one uh. PG. 13. Oh, geez. But. No! Close. It's so close. I can oh no, 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 no! Everybody in when it wins. De -de 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 -de. Ah! Ah! Good game. Good game. Good game. We're shaking hands. Right? <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. That was really, really good. I was. It was very close. Very, very close. I'm massively disappointed to lose again. <laughs> <laughs> we, will, we will have a stream where Josh does win. Um, we, uh, we no, are no, it, it has we happened. Are... It has happened. Don't make out like it hasn't happened. It has happened. <laughs> Which one was it? <laughs> but, uh... Uh, okay, so guys, if you've got any questions, uh, we're going to be finished up in like well, five, t five minutes or so. Um, we have been Mod Josh T and uh, G Mod G Dog. If you want to follow us on Twitter, that would be awesome. My handle is Jagex Josh, Jagex Josh T, and yours is not that complicated. It's <laughs> Jared Ward. Uh, Jared Ward. So follow us and and say how. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Adil, for my. Uh, I just have to believe. I do believe. I just don't feel like Megatron believes in me. I feel that's where I'm. I'm being let down. Maybe I need to switch <laughs> tides and be a bit of a flipper and uh, bow down to Optimus, and maybe I'll be better off. You know what? <laughs> it's okay to come over to the Autobots, by the way. Never. Just Never. I didn't order a, a blue and purple t-shirt to then switch sides to the Autobots. That's a good point. Do you like my What's new t-shirt, guys? I really <laughs> like my new uh, t-shirt. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, I have forgotten all of my training. Barasa is not going to be happy. I need to get straight back into training. Uh, <laughs> I will. Um, I will do. Uh, 
Thanks for bringing back Crisis Mode. No worry, thank you for enjoying Crisis Mode. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> and yeah, we really do like it. And uh, yes, as I, as we said, like it was because we were focused very much on um, PvP, mm. uh, and so that's why we we've, we've added it back in because uh, we we're, we're more balanced. The next update we do brings in more balance on the bots and everything like that because that's because we've that's what we've been focused on. So yeah, it's um, improving, exciting. There's a lot of news coming up, obviously. It's easy to say that, but there is. So just you know, keep checking our forums, check the website. We'll be sending you emails. If you've not signed up, go to transformersuniverse.com. Um, create a uh, commander name. Choose your What's side. your Twitter handle? I'm just going to jump it into the trap. Just spell it. G E R. Nope, that's not how you spell my name. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Okay, hey, uh, Silver Misto, Silver Misto, uh, it, it's not a download um, when uh, when you get added into the beta. If you just go to the site, uh, there will be a, a play now button if you get accepted into the beta. Uh, when can someone expect his key if he registered a a month ago? Uh, we're not doing it on time based. Uh, it's done on uh, the performance of your computer, uh, the needs of each beta test, and your location. So. Um, you know, we're just we're looking for you know. Uh, to be honest, uh, we sent out some new invites yesterday, and I think some invites I are going. I think we sent them out today as well. Uh, well some invites are coming out so, very um, regularly. This. Keep uh, an eye out on your. Um, I've just noticed my hair looks horrible. Apologies for that. Stream is cancelled. <laughs> Whoa, that looks so weird. I'm, I apologise. Obviously, this is the first time I've streamed, and I had um, two arms. But so um, yeah, please keep. Um, and I on your e emails inbox. Yeah, we'll, we'll let you know as, as soon as like we are inviting a lot of people now, which is exciting. So the game's getting more busy. Yeah. Um, and with these updates that we're doing, um, our Twitch streams are going to be more interesting. Yes. So uh, keep keep in the. Keep this in game is us. amazing. Why did we make it? We made it because we wanted to make an amazing game. <laughs> <laughs> no. So uh, we are Jagex. Uh, for those who don't know, um, and our main game that we made is oh, called RuneScape, which has been running for 13, 14 years now. Uh, which is your traditional MMO. It's one of the first like fantasy-based MMO RPGs before World of Warcraft mm. and everything like that. It's like got 240 million accounts and counting, um, and. Uh, we worked very closely with Hasbro uh, three or four years ago to come up with a concept to make a Transformers online game. Uh, and that's what we've got. And so we've taken a lot of learnings from the games we've made in the past and the games we're making presently to make a game that fits very well into the Transformers brand. You know, it's all about you know, fighting as, you know, in this massive ongoing faction war as your Transformers, unlocking different ones, using their strengths and weaknesses and playing your role as a commander uh, to fit the, the like the strengths and, need, and needs from your team. Mm -hmm. Couldn't have said it better myself. I'm drawing now. When will the um, female Transformers who aren't motorbikes, dune buggies, or founders start being designed? Uh, we have a lot of, uh, you know, uh, how can I say this without uh, uh, spoilers? Uh, so basically, <laughs> at the moment, we are focused very much on land vehicles for launch. We have, you know, we have a, a very big plan for this game. We are building a. Universe, universe, as the name suggests. So we will, uh, you know, we've got plans for things like that. If you've seen, you might have seen in the press, you know, there was an interview uh, article on Kotaku. Kotaku. If you want to check that out, there's some detail there about what we're kind of what we've got planned for the future. Do, yeah. um, but we do have, you know, we we we, you know, we've announced three female bots so far. Yeah, um, she's pretty good going. Two playable so far. When uh, to come? Oh, and is there any in the founders? Is Australia or is she? Australia. Is there, yeah, oh, she's. Definitely. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. So we 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 are very much representing for female bots. I got shouted at. I was at Gadget Show Live, uh, and I was doing an on stage presentation every day, and we were talking. It was me and uh, two guys who used to be in Hollyoaks, and we were talking about uh, fembots, and I got shouted at by some a uh, couple of people there for calling them fembots. So I apologise. Female Transformers. A, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it, it, it goes back to Austin Powers, wasn't it? The yeah, I don't. Yeah, she but uh, fembot, but. All along. We don't call them male bot, so why should we call them That's true. bots? That's true. So there you go. I apologise. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know, at least it's something that we need to pick up. Um, yeah. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, if you do, if you are going to be at any of the events that we're attending, make sure you. Sorry, uh, Crisis Bulgaria. What is your question? I ha I am not. There's a uh, lot of questions, like or a lot of texts we have to find. We're not, we're not ignoring you. Uh, we won't start a third faction. <laughs> it's very much all about Autobots and Decepticons. Uh, that's you know the two factions. Um, so yeah. 
yeah, we were joking about the um, undecided. There is, you know, presently no undecided where you just walk around the town and, and grow energon crops. Mm. No, so that's fine. Yeah. Uh, a couple more questions, and then uh, so someone's asked about flying bots. Someone's asked about Dino bots. Like we're very aware of the demand of what you guys want. You know, uh, if you head to our forums, you can uh, voice your opinions there. But you know, at the moment, as I said, for launch, we're focused on the bots that we've announced, which are land-based vehicles. Uh, if you check out under the hood, we talk about uh, track-based vehicles as well. So. Uh, stuff like tanks, uh, what we're working on, and um, obviously we know we're, we're very well versed in Transformers law, and, you know, and what we want to do. Uh, so, of course, just you know, this is an online game. What we launch with at uh, when we're going to open beta will be it's only just the beginning. Yeah, it's basically. the beginning. We'll be adding all the time mm. and adding new modes, adding new vehicles, adding new warriors, and everything like that. So. Um, do not worry about that. We have, you know, if there's things that you want, head to our forums, let us know, and we'll, we'll, we will try and make you ha as happy as possible over the n uh, coming months. And years. <laughs> and years. Yes. Um, someone wants a Hello Kitty skin respray for a showdown. Banned. <laughs> it would be a good, you know what, it would actually be really insulting to be smacked with a hammer of Hello Kitty. Yes. Very violent for Hello Kitty, I don't think that's a very Hello Kitty-ish thing, yeah. but I would put them off, definitely. Yeah, no, I, I, I'm all up for it. I will tweet Hello Kitty right now and get that happening. Uh, someone's asking about uh, familiar characters, Cyclops, Hawk, Vulcan, what a name, I like it. Mm. Cyclops, Hawk, it's my favorite uh, I like your name. Um, um, sorry, just cancelling the match there. Uh, familiar characters. Um, at the moment, we, we, we do have, the, uh, for those of the pizza, Pete guys in the pizza, you will see that they do play a role. Uh, we haven't announced their full role yet. Uh, keep an eye on our channels. We will be announcing they that in the future. Um, <laughs> Pooh Bear is another good idea for uh, skin, yes, of course. <laughs> Pardon, sorry? No, I'm just saying. Oh, uh, Pooh Bear, yes. And it was TikTok, oh, definitely. It was a good suggestion. Yes. Uh, we're going to ruin everyone's childhood memories. Tick. Yes. With uh, We are Michael Bay. Uh, boom. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I take that back. I love you, Michael Bay. You make great <laughs> films. Just please don't make Megan Fox April O'Neil. It just makes me sad. Um, She's watching. <laughs> she is watching. She's a fantastic actress. Fantastic. 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 If she spoke yes. like this, it would be, oh, wouldn't be a terrible accent. But too, uh, really release a bot with Mod Crow's face on it. I would love that because then I can just destroy him. Uh, <laughs> yes. That would be unfair. Everyone would go and, and, and pick on that one character. Okay, guys, I think that is it. We've hit our over our, our limit. Um, thank you very much for watching. Uh, we love you all. Thanks for queuing in, uh, tuning in, even. Um, <laughs> Please head to our transformersuniverse.com to sign up for beta. Please head to our forums. Please follow us on Twitter. Uh, yes. Thank you to G-Dog for hanging out to, Hello, uh, thanks today. Thanks for Come on and board. And you will be seeing more of him and his beautiful, beautiful, beautiful face. So. <laughs> I thought you were, oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Thank you, guys. Thanks See you very soon. Much. See you.